Hey guys, thanks for joining me on Neri's Kitchen. Today we have Coach Shelly in the house to share her top five secrets on how to succeed during a belly burn challenge. Thanks Neri. Yes, I definitely want to share my top five tips in a belly burn challenge. First of all, the one that uh, I always uh, like to talk about and make sure that people are consistent and that consistency will create change. So I always talk about CCC. What do you mean by consistency, Shelley? Consistency is basically everything. Be consistent with your workouts, be consistent with your food, be consistent with your sleep, your water, everything. That consistency is what's gonna keep you going when those times are tough, when you are not really sure that you wanna get up in the morning and go. If you just think about it, the three C's will get you up in the morning and get you going. So basically build a routine, build those habits, be Absolutely. consistent every day, yeah. got it. My second tip is do not be afraid of protein powder. A lot of people think that protein powder is got a lot of uh, hidden ingredients inside of it. Um, definitely you want to make sure when you're buying your protein that you're looking at those things, but protein powder is made from milk. So it's the whey from the milk. Mm -hmm. So don't be afraid of that. It builds muscle. It's a great source of added protein. Eating a lot, when you're adding a lot of protein, it's very hard to get in eating it by food. So eating it um, as, a, with, as a liquid just allows you to eat more food and make sure you're eating the right amount of uh, calories in a day. Um, they're, not, they're perfectly natural. They're from whole foods. In my opinion, a whey isolate is a much uh, better bang for your buck. You're getting more of a pure, uh, higher protein uh, way than a different type of way. So you want to look for an isolate way. Um, it's first processed further. Mm -hmm. So what that does is uh, remove a lot of the fats and the carbs. So you get for your calories, you're getting a higher percentage of protein. And it's also a faster absorbing protein. Is that correct? Correct. Like when I say faster absorbing, I mean your body absorbs it faster. Correct. Okay. There is another protein as well that I suggest to individuals in my uh, belly burn and it's casein. Okay. And casein is a great uh, protein for an evening shake. So most of the individuals in my group, if that's what they're interest is it, interested in, is building more muscle, is that uh, they would take a protein shake before they stopped eating mm -hmm. and kind of as their last thing before they go to bed. And there's a whole science into why that's done. And um, that kind of goes into one of my other um, tips is to educate yourself and educate yourself. When I say that, I mean, know what you're doing. Don't just have somebody tell you eat this, this reason that for, for any reason you, I want you to understand it. Mm -hmm. Like I wouldn't want someone to tell me to do something and not understand why I'm doing it. So I always ask those, do you know why? So sometimes I feel like I share too much information, but I, I just, I feel that I need to share that information. So I share um, with videos and, and articles about why um, I have a really, really great, um, which I've already shared with individuals in my group about whey and casein. So that's number, number three would be to educate yourself and understand what you're doing and why you're doing that. Why, why does, uh, four liters of water help you? How does it help you? What does it do? That kind I of know thing. the answer to that question. <laughs> okay. Um, well, obviously it hydrates you, but it actually, um, Corinna was telling me it actually moves your body around. So it helps you with your digestion. You get, um, better sleep. Mm -hmm. Your skin looks better. It helps you with joints, like mm -hmm. less inflammation. Yes. So make sure you guys hydrate. And that's one of my next tips. Oh, okay. Is <laughs> exercise, food, water, and sleep for very, very important things, especially when you're doing the belly burn. Um, when you sweat, you need to replace it with water. Mm -hmm. So, uh, and the sleep, like it, it, there's so much information on sleep. So I share 
information. Again, educate yourself. Why is sleep important? Especially for women, sleep is huge um, because we um, need to, I, I'm not sure the exact, uh, how to ex explain it, but women have uh, cortisol, mm -hmm. which is goes right to your midsection right to the midsection water will actually help and sleep will help with that you need stress cortisols another thing added by stress so with sleep you're resting you're giving your body time to recoup you're repairing and, yeah okay yeah. uh the last would be to participate engage ask questions um, like I said, I like to make sure that people know exactly what they're doing and not just going by um, what they what the, they heard or or the latest trend. Yeah, 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 yeah. So those are my tips, and my last one I'll add in is have fun. I always like to um, encourage the individuals to have fun, and however we can do that. Uh, whether it's dressing up silly at the gym or taking pictures great music and, and clothes, music yeah and, yeah so but just have fun awesome yeah. well thank you so much coach shelly for sharing us your top tips on how thanks. to be successful <laughs> thanks guys for tuning in i'll see you next week bye